What's going on guys? So uh, we have switched to Sneaky Tune now. I'm sure you guys can tell by the title. Um, I used to be tuned with Unitronic. I was stage two with them and I decided, you know, we're going to try something different and that's going to be Sneaky Tune. And so far, after about a week of driving with it, it's awesome. I absolutely love it. I'm on my uh, first revision now, no longer on base map and it is doing great. Base map was even great. I thought I thought base map was even stronger than Unitronic Stage 2 personally. And I know Unitronic's honestly rather conservative with what they can push, but it got kind of boring after a while. So, we are now tuned with Sneaky Tune and we are running one of their Stage 2 maps. We uh, are running their Snap Crackle Pop files. Um, so the pops and bangs and uh, also, it's like APR, except for a little bit better, in my opinion, as far as turning them on and off. I know with APR, you have to go into your actual mode settings on your infotainment center, and uh, we'll put it out of sport and then back into it, I believe. Um, with this, you literally, you know, if you're driving a DSG, you just can go and push back and put it in sport, and do the transmission-wise, and it automatically turns on the pops and bangs. So, once you do that, here, I'll show you guys real quick. They turn on right away and uh, you can also turn them right back off so sneak tuned is uh, it's awesome so far I'm loving it but uh, we're gonna go out and we're gonna try and just get you guys like some back road driving sound clips um maybe some pulls here and there and uh, yeah so well, let's get right to it partially gutted by the way um, we are the top of the back seats are, are removed we're just we just have that bottom cushion as well as the uh, spare tire and everything like that's pulled out so we just we got the uh, trunk liner back there just so that way it doesn't look like crap and then we left the seats in so that way it doesn't look like crap to be quite honest I only weighed a few pounds so here we leave them in there yeah, let you guys hear it Put the windows down real quick though definitely loud um, I will uh, I'll insert a clip somewhere in this video maybe probably towards the end of uh, the other night I went out and just did a short little pull but we did get a flame out of it and uh, I'm sure that I can replicate that if I try so I will do that in the future this is one thing that I do really enjoy about the sneak tune that all the APR guys and I believe even EQT guys have been enjoying for a long time is having being able to turn off pops and bangs on Unitronic they were always on and don't get me wrong they weren't thuds and bangs like this is with Sneaky Tune but you couldn't turn them off like there was ways you could blip the throttle to make them not happen and it just did, like if you really needed to like for instance every time I pulled into my neighborhood tried to blip the throttles so that way wouldn't have to you know piss off all the neighbors so that happens oh here we go let's get a little pull guys are really really pushing it 12 miles an hour uphill it's as fast as they can go
Let's see if we can get you guys some of this launch control. So that's gonna be it for today's video if you enjoyed it make sure you hit that like button hit the subscribe button if you'd like to see more also if you have any ideas for videos that you'd like to see with the gti or revolving around the new tune with the sneaky tune just leave it in the comment section below i'll try and get to it and i'll try and make a video on it for you guys so uh that's gonna be it and i'll see you guys next week with another video